thank you guys so much for joining me again today. Thank you for watching the last video and for, you know, the overwhelming support. I'm so humbled. Thank you so much, guys. So today, as I promised, I want to tell you why I think you should go natural and you really should go natural. I'm Lynn and welcome to Afro Sherry, where it's all about loving you naturally. So yeah, why should you go natural? I'll give you three of my top reasons. One, going natural is liberating. I mean, it's so freeing to, to wear your hair the way it grows out of your head. First of all, I have zero or maybe just like one visit to the salon a year. Now it's going to go to two because my hair has grown longer and I only go for trims. But it's so liberating to be able to take care of your own hair, to be able to wear it just the way it comes. You don't have to conform to a certain standard of beauty. And I know it sounds cliche, but it can be really liberating to be able to see that you can look amazing with your own hair the way it comes. And the fact that you don't have to put so much um, um, effort and time into making it look a certain way. It's very liberating. And what else comes with that? Freedom is how confident you become. Just talk to just about any naturalista you know. Naturalistas are, you know, girls with who've gone natural. Any naturalista you know will tell you. There's a, this awakening of new confidence in yourself and in who you are and in how you look that comes. And it's, it's, it's really liberating and it sort of brings out a new person in you that you didn't even know was there. I know sometimes you're like, it's just hair, Lynn. Can it really be that deep? Imagine, until you go natural, you won't really know. It is deep. It really is. Yes, it's just hair sometimes, but the other side, the, the flip side rather, it, it's, it's a big deal. It's very, very liberating. The second reason that you definitely should go natural is that natural hair is unique. Not to say that rebraiding and weaving is not unique. What I mean is, the, the way the hair grows out of our heads is, is different. It's unique to each person. There are certain things called hair types, and I'll tell you about that in you know, future videos to come. Um, there are different curl patterns for our hairs. Some of you have already heard about them. You know, there's like 4A, which means your hair is probably like um, curly, you know, like an S. And there's 4B, which is coily. And then there's 4C, other people say 4ZZZ, which is really kinky. And they're all unique in their own way. And different people have a different mix of these hair types on their head. Like you can have more than one be honest and it's just unique how it comes uh, how, how it you know it portrays itself how how it looks and guess what it's also so versatile I mean you can do so much with natural hair and 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 people don't realize that but there is there's so much versatility in how you can wear it how you can style it what you can do with it whether it's long or short there's so much you can do with it it is unique and then the third thing that I believe you should the third reason I believe you should go natural is that natural hair grows long you know, believe me, see for yourself. Grows super long. My hair has never grown this long, or had never grown this long, and it had um, chem or perm or relaxer, whatever you call it, or creamy crack. It never got long. It was long to an extent, but it never got to the length it does. Natural hair grows because for the first time ever, you're probably taking care of it as you should have been taking care of it. You're letting it take its natural progression of growth. And whenever you let something thrive in its natural state, it will thrive, it will grow, and it will reward you. So if you're ever, you know, length chasing, as many of us African girls are, let's be real, most of us really do chase length, eh? you want to go natural, and you'll definitely achieve the hair. So I hope that um, you agree with that. And of course, tell me, what other reasons do you guys think people should go natural for? Or why do you think people should not? You know, I mean, you're really open and entitled to your opinion. Let me know in the comments, talk to me or you can inbox me. Um, but thank you guys so, so much for watching. Next time, I wanna now talk about, um, okay, so I want to go natural. So how do I do it? How do I go about it? Where do I start? That's going to be the topic for the next one. And I hope you'll be right here waiting because it's coming through soon. Thank you guys again so, so, so much. Please subscribe and share to your friends. And um, I'll see you next time on Afro Sherry, where it's all about loving you naturally. Mwah.